So I was talking to Dr. Bilski here about, you know, for years, dentists have been doing Botox injections and still do, still do. But we're going to talk about Botox versus microneedling, because I know some folks might, you know, uh, I'm going to get jabbed with this thing. And yeah, that's yeah. the Botox way, right? Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, pretty cool. What the fear when you're coming at them with a needle? What are you crazy? So <laughs> it may be a little Frankenstein like, but no, the uh, the reality is dentists have been using Botox for a long time. We use it yeah. in TMJ and, and migraine headache therapies. And yes, dentists do treat those. Um, but we also use it for the uh, cosmetic purposes for fine lines, wrinkles, smile lines, uh, foreheads, the 11s between your, your eyes. Um, and the other avenue that we're, we're utilizing now is what's called platelet-rich fibrin, along with micro-needling, with, along with biofillers. So what that means is in, in dentistry, when we do implant surgeries or take teeth out, we can draw blood and we can take out your growth factors in a machine called a centrifuge, make this little um, uh, randy bandage, if you, if you will, <laughs> and we place it in the area of the mouth and it helps to stimulate uh, healing. So something that would normally take maybe six to eight weeks takes about three weeks. Wow. It's remarkable. Wow. We take photographs, we, we follow. The point being is the face, we do the same thing that we can put a place on your skin and actually micro needle it, which is a pen about the size of my thumb that just goes up and down over the skin in a certain pattern. Uh, a topical Novocaine face cream is placed you sit for about 20 minutes and then we go on in there and we microneedle. And the the results are fabulous. Um, what it can do is it removes or helps to remove or eliminate or minimize fine lines, wrinkles, acne scarring, um, deep furrows in your forehead. Um, we have a book that uh, we, we give to our consultation uh our patients that are requesting facial aesthetics it's kind of neat it's like it has all the different procedures and little qr codes you can take your camera point at the code and you'll get to see more information about how that procedure actually goes right and what i like about this book which i wish it was my idea but it's not it wasn't is that i can give this to randy or whoever and they can just thumb through it and like oh wait a minute yeah you know i do have this particular problem that they're pointing out in the book and I think I want to investigate that. So now Randy comes in and says, hey, I looked at the book. I'm really interested and in, Randy's skin is fine, but I have these uh, acne um, scars and they're red. And then when I go in the sun, it gets really red. Yeah. Or if I work out, it really is pronounced. Is there anything that you can do? Like, yeah, why don't we try the microneedling? And um, we keep call it open-ended if we want to do a little lasering too. We can spot treat and whatever, like, whatever you, know, you need. Whatever yeah, I mean, appropriate it's, can it's, it's not one, you know, one recipe fixes yeah. everybody. Okay. It's, it's what is specific to you, which I love about it. And because we've been using PRF within oral dentistry, oral surgery, now as a dentist with the training that we have with head, neck, and skin, that's part of my training anyway. So dentists are really, probably really well suited. Yeah, for something sure. that estheticians have been doing and nurses have been doing. Now it's just falling into the laps of uh, dental practices. Um, there's about 25,000 dentists across the United States that do Goodness. these procedures out of 250,000 dentists. So it's starting to rise. There's an awareness and being received very well in the, the surrounding communities of any dental practice. That's really neat. Yeah. Really neat. So to get started, they can just go to your website, yeah. make an appointment, stop in, get the book. So if you're not at the website, go there right now, bilskydental.com. Thanks for sharing. This is pretty neat, pretty exciting and unexpected yeah. for, uh, for for dentistry, I guess, you know? It's fun. It's a, it's a nice little um, service yeah. that takes you out of the realm of dentistry and puts you into a, well, you, you a know, feel good. And well, we've said this before, another, another benefit of doing it is because if you don't want anybody to know you're getting stuff done, guess what? They don't have to because yeah. you're just going to the dentist. Right. So we'll just right. leave it at that. Exactly. Check it out right now, BilskyDental.com. Thanks.